All right, so I'm gonna start fall cleaning. <laughs> so I wanted to have um, a video of like my list of things that I wanna get done this fall going into winter, um, but that will be on Monday. So I'm just gonna do this one for today. Um, these are just the rooms that I want to that I want to make sure I get done. Um, I'm not necessarily going to hit every single room in the house. Um, I may or may not. I don't know, but <laughs> I want to make sure that I have a list, a goal to complete, and just get things done. So I am starting with our bedroom. Um, this is the least used room in the house, I guess you could say. We only sleep in here. Like we don't come in here and really watch TV. We. <laughs> that's why I think it has, like. There's really nothing on the walls. Um, I want to decorate it, but it's just, it's not a top priority just because we only really sleep in here. Occasionally, we've probably watched the TV like five times. <laughs> so it's not something that we spend a lot of time in here. And that's fine with me. We enjoy other parts of the house. But I figure since this is the least used room in the house, I can start in this room because it will not you know, have to be redone like this in like two months. Um, I wanna make like my living room and kitchen like the last place possible so that those rooms will be ready. That means you were climbing on the counter. Mommy, this was Shimmer Shine when we went to get Shimmer Shine bubbles. Okay, crisis averted. So, my plan is <laughs> to wash the curtains, um, and then wash my bedding, which we just recently washed the bedding, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway. It's early in the morning. Hopefully I will not forget <laughs> to put it in the dryer. That's my biggest downfall. So I'll wash the sheets and then I'll wash the comforter because it always seems to take a long time. Um, but I'm gonna get the curtains down first so that they can be done and hung up before <laughs> bedtime. Um, and I do definitely wanna talk about this. We got this to put in our um, bedroom for this fall, which I'm super excited about. So I'm gonna open that and set it up but I'm going to go ahead and get started taking the curtains down and then I'll put the clothes away and then we'll just start cleaning things. So let's go.
humidifier they did send this to me to review and I just wanted to share it into this video as I'm cleaning our room I'm getting ready for fall and winter my husband normally gets very sick with his allergies allergies are very bad in our air we do have a field in our back um, behind our house and they cut down the hay and he gets really sick from that so we usually keep a humidifier going 90% of the time in our room that one is pretty much bit the dust and I was perfectly sent they perfectly sent this in time for uh, the fall and winter time especially with kids getting sick this would be perfect so I just wanted to share this with you they did send it to me so this is the the humidifier itself it is like I want to say adorable but it's like it's really nice like look at this it's very sleek like if it's just pushed up against your wall you can kind of hide it and not really know what it is um, but it's nice like it's just <laughs> I'm, I really like it I think it has a great like appearance to it um, but I wanted to share some of the features with you I am gonna plug it up and use it but it comes with a remote which is really nice to have so if this is across yeah. you know in the corner of your room and you forget to turn it on you can just press the button cut it on while you're like almost asleep um, but on here it has let's see it has warm humidity mist level a timer light and then the display and then on and off at the top and then you have your display screen which is very nice and sleek um, and then you have your buttons right here that you can touch um, on the back it has the container that holds your water and it has a lock feature right here which is really nice so right here you would just lock it in place so once you put water in it you lock it and then you unlock it and then it comes right out and then here's your little controls on top and then you put your water down here you just twist this and it has a little hole right there so do it like and then you just put it back in there and then lock it and then plug it up and go now one other item that I thought was I thought was amazing you see this teeny tiny little box right here so this little teeny little box right here it says and you can't see it, but it says aroma so you just press this and pull it out and you can put your essential oils right in here so they don't want you to put it inside the box a lot of times essential oils can build up like the oils can build up into like the features of your um, humidifiers and it can mess it up but you just use this little pad and they send you two extras right here so you just put this in here and then you just drop in whatever essential oils or blends you might have so if your children has the flu or if they have allergies or whatever the case may be they can you can just put whatever blends lavender whatever it is and, you know you can just stick it right on that little teeny little pad and then pop it in here and it will help fill the aromas into your room which I absolutely love this feature and when you're done with that scent you just take this out and you can rinse it and clean it with warm water and then you reuse it or just switch over to another one if you need to use it right away um, but this is an amazing like additive feature like they're realizing how popular essential oils are and like the big majority of people are using nowadays so I'm gonna go fill this up with water and test it out all right so I have water in it and it does say on the bottom right here it says you have to do at least a minimum of half of the tank this does make me nervous because I'm going to tip this over but this is locked position I'm gonna make sure I turn it this way the water came out so I'm gonna lock it and then put this back and then I'm going to plug it up so I've got my remote and I pulled the little plastic tab to kind of save the battery but here's the power button at the top so you just press it and hold it down for like two seconds and then it shows right here this is the temp which is kind of funny because our temperature upstairs is set at 73 so we'll see what this changes but we have a mist up here so you can separate these at the top watch out baby I got you. so you have two going watch out. and I turned it up so this is the highest I believe my fans on let me go cut my fan off so it doesn't blow it around okay 
So we have our mist. I believe it's on full. Yes, so it's on full right here. So this is the highest setting. And it's this is not hot at all. So I'm gonna switch it to warm. I've gotta hold it down for a second. There we go. Make sure it doesn't get hot. So it's showing on the screen right here that it's on warm. 46%, 75 degrees up here. <laughs> so another feature that I think is amazing is a lot of humidifiers are coming out with the cool mist humidifiers, yeah. which they are way safer. Um, the humidifier that we had was very hot. Um, the actual top part of it would get very hot. You could not put your hand around it because you could get burned. The little piece that you have to pull out gets hot, so it's just very dangerous. So having it in a child's room Mom, is perfect if they're anything. sick because this is not hot at all. And I, <laughs> I, I would probably make sure that they're asleep because um, they'd probably play with it the whole time. Mommy, can I um, turn it to cold? Let's see what the timer is. Let's see, we have a timer. So we have it right here. I'm guessing this is hours, yeah. So you can set it for a couple hours. Uh, this is, I believe, if I read correctly, this tank will go for 30 hours. So I can't wait to use this tonight and see how it goes. Matthew is super excited because our last humidifier, like I said, is pretty bad. <laughs> but um, they are actually gonna be doing a giveaway on their Facebook page. So I will have a link down below for the um, giveaway, you can go and enter on their Facebook page. Um, I will also have their Amazon and website it. information that you can go and check them out. See if this is something that you would like to add to your family. I think the aroma box just kind of set it off, you know, it, the aroma and a control. If I have a remote to something, it makes my life so much easier. We have a remote for our fan and it changes everything. <laughs> so. Definitely check them out. They are really great products. We have the air purifier and we absolutely love it. Um, but definitely, definitely go check them out. The light is on, but you can't really tell because it's so bright. But go check them out. All right, so my bedroom is done for right now. I am perfectly fine where it's at. I've dusted, I've moved things around, I've vacuumed. Um, the carpets were cleaned if you saw that video. Um, I am moving, I moved this over here for the time being. Um, and for anybody that has watched the past couple of my um, bedroom cleaning videos, the uh, notebooks, I get a lot of hate about these notebooks. I only have two left. Do y'all remember like a couple videos ago, I had a huge stack of these. I did not have to purchase one for school this year. That saves a lot of money. So now they fit perfectly under there and nobody can see them. So I have this little area for me to like work on and use for whatever purpose. But once we take Hannah's bed down, then we will move it over there. Um, and she is doing three nights in a row sleeping all night long in her room, which is fabulous. So hopefully by this weekend, we'll get the bed taken down. Uh, but the everything has been dusted and vacuumed. The bedding was washed. Um, I had washed it. I had this video is like three days apart, so I had to wash it different, like different days. Um, but I decided to actually flip the bedding and see if I liked it like this. Uh, but we have the rocking chair here. I moved my dresser over here. Um, I figure since this is my side and then this is Matthew's side, it kind of helps. And the room looks so different, like completely different. And Snow has found her little resting place. <laughs> um, right here is just some um, school things that I feel like just is safer up here. Hannah tends to still get into things. Um, our new humidifier, which I am loving. And then my side of the bed, the bed, you know, it's all cleaned up. And I have a huge bag of clothes that are taken to Goodwill today. So bedroom done, feels good.